And how many of you were here back in 2005? I know yeah. there were some. Stand up. <laughs> Yay. I don't think we really need to ask that question anymore, thanks to your work, your work, breaking news, sharing stories, and offering up life well said. One of the things that um, we have to share with you is that this year, a very important and meaningful change uh, to this community snapped into place. According to our surveys with Nielsen, your blogs are now the most valued online source for information advice to the women who read them. That means, take that, take that. According to our surveys with Nielsen, your blogs beat corporate websites and beat social networking advice that they get. With marketers, we see an almost 100% penetration of the impact that you have on what people think, believe, want, and buy. And in the media this year, we saw a definite shift toward and to women who love as the primary source and authority for just about every major issue from food we eat, to parenting, to politics where women's voices were concerned now. That said, we are now in the bucket with how women are treated by the media in general, which will be a subject of our closing keynote. So that's not always a, a fabulous thing. But the bottom line is that the credibility gap that we have sought to bridge for women who blogs since 2005 is, we believe, officially over, and it's something we should really all celebrate.